गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स इन कॉन्टिनेशन विथ चैप्टर थ्री करेंट इलेक्ट्रिसिटी इन प्रीवियस वीडियो वी हैव डन द ओम्स लॉ एंड इट्स डेरिवेशन नॉट टूडेज टॉपिक इज ड्रिफ्ट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड ओरिजिन ऑफ रेजिस्टिविटी वन नो इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इज अप्लाइड द रैंडम थर्मल वेलोसिटीज ऑफ द इलेक्ट्रॉन्स प्रोड्यूस नो नेट करंट इन एनी डायरेक्शन वेन एन इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इज अप्लाइड each electron experiences acceleration opposite to the field direction is given now when there is no electric field is applied now see the, in this case the electric field is zero that means there is a net motion of the electron produced is zero matlab koi bhi net motion nahi hai whether the electrons are moving freely in the elect uh, conductor but because electric field is zero to yahan pe jo net result hoga in any of the direction is zero but when an electric field is applied each electron experience an acceleration opposite to the field direction now if the electric field is applied in this direction is tarah se ek field apply kar rahe hain now because of this field there is a motion of electron which is called as the drift velocity there is a motion of electron in the opposite direction of the electric field the motion of electron in this direction and electric field is in this direction तो वो जो एक्सोलेशन प्रोड्यूस करेंगे बिकॉज ऑफ दिस इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इज गिवन बाय गिवन बाय ए इज इक्वल टू माइनस ई कैपिटल ई डिवाइडेड बाय एम नो द एक्सोलेशन इज प्रोड्यूस बिकॉज ऑफ दिस इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड इज गिवन बाय माइनस ई कैपिटल ई अपॉन एम वेयर ई इज द चार्ज ऑन द इलेक्ट्रॉन एम इज द मास ऑफ द इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड ई इज द इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड over a time interval delta t the change in velocity of an electron due to the field e is equal to the product of acceleration and time interval suppose over a time interval the change in the velocity since the electric field is apply in this direction because of this electric field suppose ek electron yahan par hai ek small delta t time mein wo yahan se move karke yahan par aaya so there is a change in the velocity so change in the velocity due to this electric field is given by change in velocity is delta v is given by acceleration into small time interval If tau is the average time between collisions the average drift velocity of the electrons is equal to the product of acceleration and tau no if tau is the average time between the collisions average time between the collision matlab suppose ye electron hai isne yahan pe collide kara iska koi delta t time aaya फिर इस इलेक्ट्रॉन ने इसको कोलाइड करा तो यहाँ पे डेल्टा टी टाइम है फिर इस इलेक्ट्रॉन ने इसको करा तो इसका डेल्टा टी टाइम हो सकता है बहुत स्मॉल हो तो एवरेज टाइम बिटवीन द कोलिजन जितने भी इलेक्ट्रॉन्स हैं इन्होंने कुछ ना कुछ कोलिजन करी तो उनका जो एवरेज टाइम ऑफ कोलिजन द एवरेज डिफ्ट देन एवरेज ड्रिफ्ट वेलॉसिटी ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन इज गिवन बाय एक्सलेशन इन एवरेज टाइम दैट इज टॉप tau the quantity tau is called the relaxation time it is a measure of time for the system to relax back to thermal equilibrium through collision current density is given by j is equal to minus ne vd putting the value of vd in the above equation we get j is equal to ne square tau upon m multiplied by e now current density current density is given by is denoted by capital g is equal to the net charge kitne number of electron n the charge on electron into the drift velocity it is called as the current density ki kitne particular area ke andar ya kitne uske andar uh, electrons hai and multiply their velocities and after putting the value of vd from the previous relation you will get the n e square tau upon m into e hence conductivity of the material is given by sigma is equal to n e square tau upon m and resistivity of the material is given by rho is equal to m upon product of n e square and tau now conductivity of the material is given by 
sigma n e square tau upon m and resistivity of the material is given by sigma m n e square tau मतलब कंडक्टिविटी इज इनवर्सली प्रोपोर्शनल टू द रेजिस्टिविटी तो इनके फॉर्मूले एक दूसरे के अपोजिट हो जाएंगे मोबिलिटी द मोबिलिटी ऑफ अ मोबाइल चार्ज कैरियर इन अ कंडक्टिंग मटेरियल इज डिफाइंड एज द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द ड्रिफ्ट वेलोसिटी पर यूनिट इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड मोबिलिटी म्यू इज इक्वल टू वी डी अपॉन ई व्हिच इज इक्वल टू ई टाउ अपॉन एम मोबिलिटी इज डिफाइंड एज द मोबिलिटी ऑफ ए मोबाइल चार्ज कैरियर मोबाइल चार्ज कैरियर कौन है यहाँ पे इलेक्ट्रॉन इन अ कंडक्टिंग मटेरियल इज डिफाइंड एज द मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द ड्रिफ्ट वेलोसिटी मैग्नीट्यूड ऑफ द ड्रिफ्ट वेलोसिटी इन रेस्पेक्टिव इन रेस्पेक्टिव साइन पर यूनिट इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड एक पर यूनिट इलेक्ट्रिक फील्ड में कितना उसने ड्रिफ्ट वेलासिटी मूव करा है विच इज गिवन बाय बाय म्यू it is e after replacing the value of vd from the previous relation you will get the final result is e tau upon m where m is the uh, mass of the electron e is the charge on the electron and tau is the relaxation time now our next topic is limitations of ohm's law although ohm's law has been found valid over a large class of materials There do exist materials and devices used in electric circuits where the proportionality of V and I does not hold. The deviations are of the following types. So we have seen in the first class of Ohm's when we have done the Ohm's law, it was found that the uh, relation between the V and I will get a straight line. That means the Ohm law. obey there now there are the certain cases where the ohms law does not obey there are the certain cases that we are going to study so these are as follows the relation between v and i depends on the sign of v on reversing the direction of v keeping its magnitude fixed does not produce a current of the same magnitude as i in the opposite direction suppose here v is in this direction and i is in this direction we will get a graph of v and i is like a straight line somewhere like this is applying the potential is uh, increasing in this direction and ampere is increasing in this direction in the same condition if we reverse the direction of v we will not get the same curve like the curve in the when the the direction of uh, potential is in this direction you are getting this curve in reversing the direction of v you are getting the result in this direction because the current is in the opposite direction that will not produce that much of current since the potential is in the negative direction or in the opposite direction v ceases to be proportional to i there is more than one value of v for the same current i a material exhibiting such behavior is gallium arsenide there is a material which is called a gal gallium arsenide here you will see the graph of gallium arsenide if we voltage and current is apply uh, in the conductor to so, yahan par aapko for the same value of potential difference these are suppose these are the two points of same value potential difference the value of current is uh, the different value of potential is there yahan par yahan pe different value of potential hai but you are getting the same current this type of behavior there is a limitation of ohms law i end up with this session continue this topic in the next class good day